of this conference, which is what has brought us here today. We are here to clarify one of the darkest episodes in human history. We are here to look for compensation for a suffering that can never be expiated. We are here to ensure we do not forget the most awful memory known to man. I hope that memory will instill in us the humility and urgency to do our work in a spirit of honesty and trust. And to each of the countries and NGOs present for their participation. We're not responsible personally for what may have happened in the past. We are responsible, however, for making sure we know the past, we uncover the past, we, un we unveil the past, we learn the lessons from the past, and that we act upon those lessons in the present. For any country is not what it... Okay, questions. Yes. And we're getting to hear some real good stories, the Czech story about what happened there, gold is very fascinating, and what happened, how it went to Switzerland, et cetera. So it's going to be, I think, a very revealing conference over the next few days. What wants to do? The only thing that's changed is the report of the Berger Commission, the initial report that came out, as to the uh, admitting uh, about admissions about victim gold and about the fact that they had these gold transactions. I think that's very good and fortunate and forthcoming. I hope the Berger Commission will continue to look into what did happen with truth and, and with transparency so that our work can be done and we can uh, then put this all behind us. What are they not going to do? Thanks very much. I'm sorry.